I still don't understand the difference between being spotted and not being spotted. If there's a distance, if there's light, I don't I don't know what the, the formula is, and I haven't been able to figure it out based on playing the game, which is what I was kind of going for. I didn't want to have to Google how that all got done. Okay, so I feel like I've been here before. I have. This was the spot that I said for sure was something plot related, and it was. It is something plot related. I was just like, there's no way that this is not plot related. I remember there was a statue there that I wanted to check out. There it is. The giant Scalon statue. Uh, so let's go through the official entrance this time. I knew this place had to be special. And there should be something here to attack me. Where the hell did you come from? Damn it, Scalon. Ugh, let me attack. Could you let me do that? Is that too much trouble? God, they gotta leap on him. Alright, let's uh, use one of these uh, sucky ones. Oh, fucking A. You gotta be kidding me. Okay, let's restore my health now. So much for this stuff giving me increased defense. Good god. Oh, shit. The fucking leap that they got. Okay, down goes one. Here's the other guy. Uh, where's another damage? There we go. It's not very much. But every little bit helps. Did I not hit that guy? Apparently I didn't. God, they got some health on him too. Okay, I think... He, nope. I was about to say, I think he's dead. He is not dead. God, these guys are ridiculous. I do not like the scale lines. I do not like them at all. Do they have like a regenerate on them? Because it feels like... That thing is going up when it shouldn't. Okay, they're finally down. How many are... He's got six of them on him. And that's not nearly as much as I would like. I'm only... I'm down to a, less than 150 now. Still... There's no way that was just four arrows I launched at that douche. Okay, let's drop another save. Let's see what I can switch to here. Do I have the bow of the dynamo still going? I do, but I still need to charge it. What do I got in here? Why don't I have any... Oh, that's because I haven't been using that. Yeah, I got it. Use another common. There we go. And we'll switch to... What do I have? Uh, I don't really have anything more than this. I have steel arrows more than this. We'll switch over to steel. Do these... They do a little bit less than the silver, but... Uh, that's fine for now. I found Milkar! Okay, so... Which, this way. Just kind of following the path. Right? No. Oh no! Komodo dragon! Come on, it is a water type. Electricity should be very effective against him. Damn it, I bet he's water ground. If I did get his soul, which is good. Come to me, Baliwag. No, polywags are definitely just pure water. And he was not evolved enough to get fighting going for him. He was definitely on the level of Polywhirl, not Polywrath. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. We're gonna be doing these guys. God. I do not like them. I don't like most of the enemies around here. Mostly because they take a shit ton of arrows to kill. That is the primary reason that I don't like them. Otherwise, they seem to be very nice. But they take so much time. Oh, we got more. And then there's a gnarl up there. It, the problem is, is that these guys aren't really dangerous to me. Uh, this, yeah, these guys especially. Holy crap, they do not do a lot of damage. But they d still take, what, five, six shots? Even when I'm magically charged to kill? That's the issue. 
Oh, come on. That went, like, right through his chest. Down he goes, though, finally. Give me your bark, and we'll head in here. He defeated it. Oh, is there any enemy that around here that I like? Probably not. Knights of Order, though. That's who we're going to be facing in here. In Zetrin, in Milkar. Yeah, this place. You ju it just had the feel of it, you know? As we're taking on more scalons. I should still be hitting... What? How does this douche see me? How does he see me? That is not nice at all. Am I already out? I think I, I think it's already out of charge. Oh god. Yeah, it's already out of charge. So, let's try to recharge it. How is it already out? Okay, is there a star? Please have a greater. Thank you. Boom. Back up to full. Now I think that I got another greater. I don't know what the first thing that I got was on the bow. It was probably one of the elytras. It could have been the Komodo, though. The Ballywog. Yeah, I don't... Let's just go this way. There is one thing... No, this is exploring. I was about to say that if there's one thing about this game that I don't like, it's that they don't really encourage exploring very much. And summon a spider, Deidre. Uh, not really. Because they don't really give you that much experience. You don't really get any levels. Any more than doing anything else. And there's no rewards, really. Just like random loot. That's all you're going to get. Which is, you know, this kind of stuff. Gold, lockpicks, arrows. Maybe a couple alchemy supplies. Maybe a torch or two. That's, that's pretty much it. That's, that's what you get. Oh, God. But you do have to take on quite a bit of enemies in order to do it. So, and especially since I'm using arrows, you know, a lot more than I'm getting back. You can just, you know, take that off the list. I lose arrows by going in here, so... I don't know, it doesn't really seem to encourage it. Uh, at least in Morrowind, there was... A chance that you could have found this super awesome whatever piece of equipment oh great so not only am I gonna be attacked constantly by that thing I can't even see my enemy because he went invisible and I don't know where he went and as far as I can tell there's really no way for me to be able to see him until he respawns God. And he's got that fucking death claw leap. Damn that death claw leap. Goes around corners like they were nothing. Come on, just smack him in the back. We got this. God, there we go. Down he goes. I don't know, maybe that's just me. It, it doesn't feel like they encourage it very much. I do like the exploring, but it feels like I'm doing it sometimes and it's just killing time and, and it's not really worthwhile. Is there a way I can turn this off? Okay, it, does that turn you off? Yay! It did. He's no longer firing at me, I don't think. Uh, this way. Even in the required dungeons, though, you know, if it's just going to be the junk loot, which is, you know, the stuff that I'm not really using, but could be useful... doesn't always seem worthwhile. Oh, that's just kind of my opinion on it. At least with Fallout, there was a lot greater chance that you were going to find something. But, you know, when was the last time I found an upgrade in a dungeon, in a chest, or anything like that? I did find this bow off of somebody, yes! But that was like... What? 50 parts ago? <laughs> and even though I've been going through countless dungeons here in the uh, in the expansion I still haven't found anything better and I could craft something better I'm sure but 
you know, when we... I would need a lot of amber to get that done. I'm, I'm wondering what killed him, and they're not really showing me. Did he just fall from there? He has got a terrible acrobatic stat then. You're still jiggling for me. Nicely done. Let's save before we go into the nexus. Are they going to make probes here? Are you going to speed up the building of something here? Nothing. Okay. You're going to build a mothership? Why is it so quiet? We got this one. Yes, sees me? I think so. It says yes. Got to wait for you to get up, though. I can't hit them while they're down. Now, though, I'm sneaking. While... While she was on the ground, could not see me. Or she, while she was on the ground, she could, but then as soon as she got up, she lost me somehow. Hit the giant bulbous thing. Oh, come on, you danced over there. That is not fair. Get your ass up. Get up so I can kill you. Thank you. There we go. There we go. That is what I wanted to see. Give me something here. Yeah, just the icon. As I really should expect by this point. Oh, another one. Just constantly go for the bulbous part of them. That I know I can hit and counts. That at least counts. Don't know where to go from here. But I'm probably going to just head straight for... Whatever it is that they want me to do. Lovely. I have barely avoided that. If they give me something that looks like this, though, they usually try to hide some amber in there. So I'll check these, but... They haven't been very nice with the amber. Aegis again. More shield. I will take it. I'm so used to that in terms of uh, Final Fantasy logic that I'm not necessarily used to it. In this context. Yeah, it's another grader. Uh, where am I going here? To the Grove of Reflection. But you have it pointed this way, but the thing is here. Okay, bad waypoint. Thank you. Let's move on. I've arrived in the Grove of Reflection, according to Dias. I must locate the Tree of Shades and find a way to reveal my true self before I will be allowed to take one of its branches. Reveal my true self once again. You want me to kill something, don't you? I guess I dropped down. I don't really have a choice. And they gave me something to land on, so... Guess there's no turning back now. Not that I really want to, but... Oh, there's, there's no way this is going to be something good. An unseen... F okay. It's so good that they won't even let me... Touch it. What do we got? What do you want me to do? What? It is you. Oh, snap. Oh, after to fight Korax Banderas. He used summon. No. Holy crap, he's kicking my ass. I cannot defeat Korax Banderas. Korax Bandanas is too difficult! He's using probably the best, like, equipment that I got. And that's not cool. Because that's cheating. Because I'm not good at using those things. Uh, uh, what am I trying to do? Damage health. There we go. Yes. Damage resisted. Oh! What? He used fire and ice? That is crap! I can't use that shit. I have it. I can't use it, though. Heal. What kind of crap is that, Korax Banderas? You're not allowed to use stuff that I can't d use because my skills aren't high enough? What are his skills? They are not the same as mine. Oh, and he's using potions and shit. That was a homing missile if I ever saw one. Damn you. And he's healing. I need to, like, silence his ass. 
Okay, tell me that silence works on him. Silence resisted. Of course it was. Anybody that I would want to silence, of course, resists it. That's just the nature of the game. Come on. And he doesn't even stay down for very long. He's got so much fucking defense. Damn it. I am a tough opponent. And he's healing again. And I can't use any, any spells on him. But I've paralyzed him. There we go. After I approached the Grove of Reflection, a shadowy image of myself appeared from the waters of the Grove and attacked me. I defeated it. And now the Tree of Shades is beckoning to me. I want to loot him. He's got like 30 of my arrows in his ass. Fine. I'm just dealing with this. As Dias requested, I've taken a branch of the Tree of Shades. I should now seek out Sirta in the Howling Halls. So we have uh, finished Zelda 2 here. We did our dark selves. How do I get out? No. Oh. This button now is activated for me. Nice. And see, look, look at this. Teleportation pad. How many times have I said that they could do this? And it's not like it's even hard. I know they have it. Where the hell am I? This just leads me out of the grove? Are you kidding me? I still got to make it all the way out of here? Come on. Fine, whatever. To, oh, this just leads outside. Thank you. To the realm of Sheagarath. We have made it out. And why do I need to load the area? We have made it out of there, which is always good. But that looks like that is going to do it, as I'm considering, like, how long is it going to take? No, it is too far. We're going to take that on next time. That is going to do it for these parts of Let's Play Oblivion. I've been joined, as always, by the light. Seducer. Kodak's Banderas. Hope you guys have enjoyed these parts. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.